today I propose you a new Zimraeli match, uh, 1v1, me vs uh, Junda, a good Zimraeli player. Um, on this game I did a lot of mistakes, um, so uh, we're gonna see them, and uh, I, uh, I will show you uh, a bit uh, what I used to do when, I, uh, when I'm playing. So, I start by uh, training one woman and a batch of five women. So the first woman train will go here on bushes. Uh, my cavalry on on the uh, chickens. The four uh, starting women on bushes. Um, three soldiers on wood. Uh, the fourth uh, the fourth soldier will build the house. And uh, as we can see here, uh, I have uh, extra bushes. Um, so I use them uh, with uh, the first woman that I trained. Uh, I take her to uh, to build a farmstead just next to them. The five, the batch of five women I trained uh, usually go all on wood, but as I have uh, extra bushes, uh, I put one or two, it depends, uh, on the farmstead to build it faster. So um, when you have extra bushes, uh, I really advise uh, to use them. Uh, that's really that's really interesting. Um, if I remember well, uh, Ale Kuzu uh, did uh, uploaded on YouTube a video about them, about uh, how useful they are. Um, so uh, you can watch uh, you can watch it. Uh, that's interesting. But I don't uh, really uh, agree with him. Well, I, I partially uh, agree. Um, but I guess that uh, I'll do a, a, a video uh, about uh, bushes. So, um, still women uh, on wood, because uh, that's uh, really important. I've taken uh, the bushes technology, which uh, increase your uh, bushes gathering rate. Still hiding houses. So, for now, um, I have uh, around 10 units on wood. My cavalry uh, hunting, hunting chicken, uh, four women on these bushes near the CC, and three or four uh, other uh, women um, on the uh, bushes uh, behind my base. So, um, this uh, map is a savanna biome, so uh, big trees with a lot of wood, but uh, really spread on the map. So, the point is. Um, to be efficient, you need to uh, have a lot of deposit. So this one is okay because uh, for uh, the, uh, the, uh, the the hundred wood this deposit cost, I have one, two, three, four, five uh, trees. So that's interesting. One trees, one tree uh, is uh, four hundred wood. So uh, I here here I have. Uh, I have 2000 wood, so that's good. I'm still training women. Um, I'm also adding a barrack here to catch this uh, stone mine. Um, Romans uh, have a barrack which costs uh, 100 wood and 200 stone, so that's good because you can, you can, um, how to say, you can uh, start building your uh, barrack uh, faster, so that's more efficient, but uh, you will need to gather stone to add more barracks, so uh, that's uh, a thing to remember uh, when you put a barrack with Romans. Um, as soon as possible, put units on stone. What I'm not doing, I'm not uh, adding people on stone. So I guess I'll add more. I, I'll, I'll add more um, units on stone uh, later. So adding a house with a lot of women. That's not that's a mistake. I'm actually, uh, I can't train uh, more units, that sucks. Adding some farms. Okay. So this barrack uh, will be built. I used to build my, to finish my barrack around uh, 6 minutes and this one is built at 4 minutes, so that's really, really soon, so not a good point. This deposit is good because I have the stone here, 1, 2, 3, 4, maybe 5 um, <coughs> trees, so that's, uh, it seems to be efficient to be uh, 
to be good. Okay, so uh, to come back um, on bushes, um, in my opinion, uh, bushes can be used uh, in a three way, in three ways. So the first one is uh, to have a, a smoother um, production of units. That's the first one. The second uh, is to have uh, to mass a lot of women. To mass, to mass, really a lot of women. So you are, you will have a, a good economy, but really, uh, you uh, how to say? If you are uh, rushed, you are uh, really in a bad situation. And uh, the last way to use bush, to use bushes, is to put a barrack faster um, and to train a soldier faster. But uh, you will have less units that, uh, than if you would uh, only train a woman. So now uh, that my uh, that my bushes uh, in the behind my base are uh, finished, I uh, I will have to to put more farms. As you can see here, still building houses. Some mistake again. Building really bad. I told you I made a lot of mistakes in this game. See again mistake. This unit going this way and finally. Uh, running, running back, walking back. That's bad. My scoot here, who uh, is idling to, really bad. Really bad. So I'm training a skirmisher in a, from my uh, barrack woman from my CC, and now. It will be yeah. I had I had farms, but at this moment, I guess it might be interesting to take farm technology from the farm from the farmstead because it costs uh, more. Farm, yeah, only uh, two hundred wood, and I have uh, yeah four hundred. So it's uh, it's okay. I might take it, but I don't. Another mistake. Same uh, at this moment, considering uh, all the all the wood I have. Uh, also, I might put another barrack, uh, or um, I might uh, put a take. Oh, sorry, uh, one woman and uh, assign her to uh, to build uh, one house like this. Uh, it's uh, the most efficient uh, I can do. But uh, while uh, this woman would be uh, building uh, building the house, uh, I would keep uh, building all the houses. Also, uh, when uh, the how to say the uh, the uh, well the uh, lonely woman uh, who will be building the house uh, will have finished to uh, will have finished the, the house, I will have uh, ten population more, so it will be a uh, good. And uh, I won't uh, fear um, any uh, population uh, limit. I won't fear this. Okay, so adding a new barrack. Well, here this barrack place is a mistake. Um, I won't win anything. There is no trees here. Here, putting the, if I uh, I've been able to put my barrack here, um, I would have won some trees more. So it it would have been good, but. Uh, Obviously, uh, it wasn't possible. So, still a lot of food and few, few wood, a uh, few, few food. Sorry. So, I need more. Uh, I really need more farms. Well, trees uh, which were there uh, are close to be finished, so I have to to put another deposit elsewhere. So I put one here, so one, two, two, three, four, five is good. Another one here might be good. One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe seven. It might be really cool too. So um, I start training soldiers from my uh, CC, so it means that my economy is okay. Hitlers. Might be good to put them on stone. 
This would be interesting. Ah, I finally uh, finished scooting. Late, but uh, better late than never. <coughs> well, considering all the food uh, I have now, um, taking a stone technology might be uh, interesting. All this uh, unused food is a lost. That's really a lost. Well, yeah. I'm trading a big batch of women because uh, I want to to use the food uh, the food stock I have. Hitlers again. Okay, I see what my uh, opponent is doing. So uh, about my opponent, um, he's uh, he's a uh, Yunda. Um, he's Iberians. He plays EAD for. Uh, a long time too, uh, maybe longer uh, than me, um, and uh, yeah, he can uh, he can offer us a good uh, good gameplay. Okay, so I take stone technology. I put this house here to be able to uh, to put a deposit further to catch wood. Okay, so this is a good view. Um, as we can see. We have one, two, three metal mines close to each other, trees, a stone mine, a mountain. So here is a spot to catch. And um, I guess that the one who will control this area will win the game. Um, because uh, in late game, middle game or, or uh, late game, metal, uh, metal is, is uh, the most important uh, resource. Um, because uh, it's... Uh, it allows you to train champions, also that's really important. Okay, so splitting my uh, woman on the different trees. So it's a bit laggy, uh, I'm sorry for this guys, uh, but uh, I haven't a powerful computer. Uh, it's a laptop, so uh, well, I do what I can. <laughs> okay, so as a, I see that my opponent is hunting. He has a lot of, uh, relatively a lot of cavalry, so it might be maybe cool uh, to to send some to send some unit here on the on his uh, hunting spot to to kill some uh, some cav. Okay, so yeah, I see that he's close to me. I see what he's doing, so yeah, I should do some Hitlers, Hitlers again. Yeah. A lot of people, too many people building the house. Too many food in stock. I really should do something. My stock are too big uh, considering uh, that uh, I'm not close to phase for now. Well, this is a mistake too. Going, going back, that's uh, a gathering lust. And healing again. Many, many mistakes. Many mistakes. Well, I'm gathering, I'm gathering uh, metal and stone uh, close to my CC because uh, this stone mine is uh, maybe too dangerous. Yeah, as you can see. So here, this is a fight to avoid. Uh, I have too few units here, so it's better to go back. To, uh, to improve my economy, then later take the fight. Well, the time that my opponent, uh, how to say, took, the time that, that my opponent took to come here, finally for nothing, and to go back is a loss for him. Also, here maybe I have the advantage. Uh, honestly, I don't know. Well, now my opponent is phase 2. I'm only phasing. Also, I have more units. I'm sensed to win the game, this battle, sorry. But uh, when units, f uh, when you phase, uh, you should know that your units uh, earn uh, some life points. That's why I'm losing this battle that I was sensed to win. 
so another mistake. Well, I think a third barrack might be really cool. I have a lot of resources. I don't use them. Okay, I had it. That's good. That's good. Also, um, this mountain is useful. Um, what I am doing here? Well, this mountain uh, is useful um, because it uh, separates my uh, my territory into uh, this side here and uh, the other side the other side here. Uh, here I have mainly my economy. The other side is f there is no uh, there uh, aren't any units, but I have many buildings to see my opponent coming uh, by this way if he does. So I phase two. I take uh, all technologies I can. Seeing my opponent is pushing on me, I go back. I can't take this fight. It will be lost. So better to avoid. Better to avoid. I don't have a lot of uh, population, but uh, on the seven uh, deal map, um, that's harder to have a, a good population, a good economy. Uh, that's harder that than on the I would say normal map. Okay, so I've trained some spearmen. I I wanted to attack uh, my opponents, but he saw it. That's good. Good reaction from Junda. Building a market, building a, a tower, a tower. Another tower here might be cool. Okay, I do it like this. My barracks and this stone mine are uh, protected. So this is a good point. Taking farm technology <coughs> and my scoot, as you can see here, is still healing. Still, still, still healing. Well, if I wanted to keep it uh, healing, it might have been better to put it here, like this. Uh, I would have seen uh, if my opponent uh, was trying to catch this area. <coughs> Okay, so now my economy is good, uh, except about wood, but uh, wood is uh, relatively difficult to catch on this map. So here I'm building a blacksmith, my last uh, phasing uh, building. I'm training a swordman. I'm training a swordman because uh, I have a lot of metal, really a few of, uh, of wood, so that's better. That's better for me. Training 15 spearmen again. Okay. Well, as you saw, I've been attacked by uh, Lunda, uh, but I didn't check. We have seen on the minimap that my uh, unit was here, but I didn't check what was happening. So that's another mistake. It should be, I don't know, the, the 23, the 23rd mistake. Really, really a bad game from, from me. But we learn from our mistakes, so well. I'm phasing to three. Um, I have a lot of uh, stone and metal, so I'll be able to to build a CC soon. I I'll, I will uh, change some food uh, for wood on the market, and uh, I'll probably try to to build the CC here. <coughs> well, if I don't, that's what I should do. Yeah, I as I told you, I'm trading, trading well, changing, but not to not to put a CC. Okay, maybe I'm waiting um, to be phase three to have uh, to have better units because, uh, as I told you, the uh, units uh, win some uh, life points by uh, every phase you you reach. Okay, I go. Yeah, that's it. I was waiting uh, to fade. Well, uh, I recorded this game um, a long time ago, maybe one month, one month ago. So I remember what more or less happened, but not everything. Okay, so I sent some women too to build uh, the CC. I saw my opponent 
has many cavalry. He's building a, a tower. I don't care uh, this tower for the moment. Uh, the most important is build the city and keep making a economy. So my opponent is uh, trying to uh, distract me, to upset me. He's uh, more or less uh, hit and uh, running me. So he attacks, he goes back, he attacks, he goes back. That's distracting. A good, uh, a good stuff from him. And he's finally pushing. That's a battle that I will lose for sure. So might be cool to go back and to bring units more, more units. Well, here this is laggy. A lot of units moving, etc. That's a mistake too. These units going uh, in the battle, but they are shot by uh, the my opponent's tower. But I'm really losing this battle. Really, really losing this battle. I've lost, well, two, oh my gosh, 30 units. Damn. That's really bad. I should train more units fast. Well, the good point is that uh, I I think that my uh, opponent has the worst economy than me, so he probably took all his army to come here. So um, even if I lose this battle, meaning I won't be able to build my CC uh, when I want, uh, at least for now, my opponent's economy. My opponent, right, yeah, my opponent's economy um, isn't uh, running. So for the moment, he has a bad economy, while mine is uh, is okay. Damn, I, my pop, my population was close to two hundred, and now I'm one hundred and thirty. So yeah, as you can see, I've uh, I've kept making economy, so I'm able to to send another army really soon. While he's obviously he obviously isn't able to, so he tries to push, but yeah, I guess he will go back. I I'm sure to win this. I'm really sure. Yeah, he goes back. But he's still a uh, hit and running. I'm training big batches of, uh, of units. He sends some uh, slingers. Slingers who are uh, really good units against uh, all kind of infantry. I'm taking some uh, military technology. Especially, yeah, well, it's a uh, range uh, unit technology because I mainly trained uh, skirmisher. Okay, so now I should train units again. Okay, so this technology that I took uh, with a soldier's uh, helmet um, is a technology which allows you to to train uh, champions from uh, barracks. So that's interesting. So I keep uh, trying to build uh, the CC. My opponent says uh, that. Uh, He's, uh, he's done. Well, probably because, uh, as I uh, supposed, um, he's, uh, he sends, uh, he sent uh, all uh, all uh, soldiers he had to prevent me to build the CC. Okay, I remember here. This will be a big, big, big mistake. I'm splitting skirmisher and spurman. It seemed to me as a good stuff, but it won't. I'm losing this battle here with my, uh, with my skirmisher. My spearmen are uh, alone. I'm, I'm training 15 uh, champions, swordsmen champions. Yeah, and my opponent saw that I've split my units. Also, I tried to attack, but he has range units. Also, he'll be able to hit and run me. And I won't be able to, to do anything except uh, 
trying to, to go back. And I will lost a lot of units. I have 29. Let's see how, how many I will have later. So I keep making economy. I need wood. I really need wood. And still no CC here. I'm trying again. So try. My so try. Some champions. Hitlers again here. Bad. Try to revive my wood production. Yeah, as I told you, yeah. it's an all army he had, and so uh, his wood production was really bad. Well, I've lost. I had 29. I got 22. I've lost seven units for nothing. A bad uh, operation for me. Well, now I can take the fight. I mean my sis. I mean my territory. He's will relatively close to me. Yeah, that's good too. But Hyundai, he's a. Uh, He's careful. He's careful. My champions are uh, attacking the this tower. I try to take it down, but uh, I guess it will be difficult. Yeah, I should go back. I will lose my champions. They cost really a lot, so that would be a bad, bad, bad operation. So, as my opponent seems to love range in it, especially cavalry, I decided to train a uh, range cavalry too. And let's see, uh, <laughs> let's see uh, who will win with uh, with those units. Okay. So this CC is built. I take, uh, I control the uh, the area I wanted. So that's good. I'm phase three. It's phase two. I'm close to win. I think I'm close to win. So now the point is uh, put some pressure on him. Try to to find uh, workers to kill them to uh, damage his economy. A fortress here, it's okay. He's building a, a temple, but I can't uh, attack it because of this tower. But my uh, my cavalry almost didn't fight at all, but because of this tower, uh, they have lost a lot of uh, life points. A lot of fiddlers again, oh my gosh. <laughs> many, many mistakes. This is useless. This is really useless. My opponent doesn't care uh, this farmstead, so for uh, for him it's no problem. It knows again. I tried; it was okay, but finally it's not. I'm not uh, careful enough. So now the good point would be um, product some rams, attack the wall, this wall. Well, no. Um, a little uh, advice um, when. Your uh, opponent uh, has walls. Uh, you should not attack walls like this or wall turrets like this. But uh, you should attack doors. Why you should attack doors? Um, you should know that doors have, have uh, less uh, life points that, than than um, wall or uh, wall turrets. So the uh, door uh, will be uh, took down faster will be taken faster. So that's to, to remember. So yeah as I told I'm sending my cavalry on the other side of the map to try to catch to uh, sorry to to kill some uh, some wooders. Well attacking this farmstead with uh, my rams uh, is a mistake too. Um, my opponent didn't knew I had uh, I had siege weapon, but now uh, he does. Okay, so I fight. I found. I, <laughs> I found uh, some. So let's uh, do some kill. Okay. So now I wanted to to attract uh, my opponent's uh, 
units close to my fortress to kill them, but uh, Yunda, Yunda reacted well. Okay, so now it would be uh, it would be the good moment to push. Two rams, three. Yeah, that's a good moment, I guess. Okay, so I'm garrisoning my rams. Um, that's the stuff uh, I really advise. Um, I used to do this. That's a surprise. That's a good surprise effect for your opponent. Uh, usually, people don't garrison their uh, rams. But uh, uh, as you will see, if I remember well, um, this uh, little tactic did uh, a lot of uh, problem to him. So I'm pushing a bit. My opponent only see three rams. He might think, well, it's okay, but 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 but. Yeah, I just garrison them, and I'm probably able to take down this fortress, uh, this uh, tower. Sorry. Okay, it's done. Now the good point would be attack this barrack or the the other tower. Many lows again here too. I don't see. I don't see it. Well, here on the mini map. Here I have Idlos. I probably wanted to build a CC, but I haven't uh, the metal needed, so I have to wait. Well, I finally have it, thanks to market. And I will harass my opponent again. Uh, we can see that my opponent uh, have, uh, has rich, he has rich uh, phase uh, phase three. So he might be able to produce siege weapons and uh, champions. Well, it seems that I find yeah some units. It, my opponents try to attract me close to his walls to uh, to kill my uh, my cavalry, but uh, I I care uh, about them a lot. I don't want to lose them. That's good because uh, he knows that uh, I have cavalry uh, here. Uh, you have to be careful about this. That's a good point for me. That's a good point for me. I'm uh, repairing this uh, ram. That's good. That's a stuff that uh, I uh, rarely do, but uh, I do it, so it's good. Okay, so my opponent uh, has uh, built uh, an outpost to see uh, if I was coming by this way. That's a good reaction from him. I like this. I have four rams. They are uh, garrisoned with uh, with champions. That's good. Another outpost. Well, this one wasn't really use uh, useful, I guess. My opponents, my opponent tried to push with a ram to take down my tower, but unfortunately for him, uh, I react fast and I'm pushing. Well, it's a double push. He's pushing on me. On me, I'm pushing on him. That's really an interesting uh, moment. He doesn't react. Well, I guess he, he doesn't have the uh, units needed to react here. So, well, this temple is really useless. I don't. Uh, that's yeah, that's useless to attack this. Well, now I have the map control. So. My opponent, if I don't manage to, to uh, how to say, to beat him thanks to units, thanks to military fight, I can try to, uh, to beat him thanks to uh, making him suffocate. Uh, so um, adding, uh, adding towers, fortresses all around the borders, and, uh, and take and uh, come with a uh, catapults with catapults to uh, to take all uh, his uh, 
buildings, but uh, it's DG. You know, see that uh, he won't be able to come back. He failed this push. Mine uh, was uh, su successful. So yeah, it's this is GG with this fortress. Uh, it's a uh, that's done, and he, at the end uh, he got to go. He had to go. Sorry. So yeah, it's GG. I'd like to see what he had. Okay, he didn't have a lot of farms, so probably a bad uh, food economy. Let's see stats. Whoa. Whoa. I didn't. I I wouldn't have bet that uh, I had uh, more than uh, than uh, the double of his uh, economy. I I'm really surprised. Okay, so military he wants. Uh, he won. He won. Yeah. Okay. Uh, indeed. Uh, uh, I lost a lot of units. I lost a lot of units because of all the mistake I did. Okay. Uh, yeah. I trained uh, nearly two times the uh, units more. Okay, but I lost a lot compared to him. Resources, yeah, it's double. And yeah, if you see a kill death, uh, yeah, kill loss ratio, you see that uh, I played really bad. I played really bad. While uh, he offered us a good game, that's why uh, that's why uh, I had uh, so so many difficulties, so many problems to win this. Okay, uh, well guys, uh, this is finished. This is finished. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed, and uh, see you later. Bye bye.